Uh, I mean, it's been it's been a good process. You know, it's been a a good experience overall um, from a playing aspect and a learning aspect. You know, I've learned so much about the game of football and how pro teams do things. And um, that's pretty much been it. And, you know, I'm looking to go day two, day three, you know. That's all I know. Uh, more complimentary coming in on third downs and um, pretty much getting the ball out of backfield, you know. Playing a little bit of slot here and there, motioning, you know, just trying to cause numbers against the defense. So, How did you feel about today? Uh, there were some highs and there were some lows, um, you know. Ran pretty good, ran better. Uh, wasn't my best runs, but, you know, Better is never worse. And um, overall, it was good, you know. Um, there's a couple couple catches I'd like to have back. But uh, you live and you learn. Uh, it's all part of the process. But for the most part, I think I did. I had a pretty average day. Have you heard from any particular teams more than any other in terms of No, it's all been about the same for the most part. Not yet. Not as not yet. Um, it'll be a little bit of anger, a little bit of happiness, and a little bit more anger, you know. Um Because I personally believe I'm a day one guy and I should be going day one, but it's not in my hands. So I'm going to be happy with whatever, whichever team I end up with, but I'm going to be angry that there was backs taken before me. I really don't know. If it was up to me, I'd probably just be uh, a loner by myself. Just get my phone call, watch it, and then go on. But, uh, Say it again. Um, you said that there are some catches that you wanted to have back. Where did you see in those particular passes? What I see in those particular passes? Uh, I just didn't focus. I wasn't focused. Uh, a little bit of nervous, which you rarely say, hear, that, hear me say that. But uh, I was a little bit nervous, had a little bit of butterflies, you know. Wanted to catch it too perfect and just, instead of just making a catch, you know. Oh, of course, of course, 100%. Where have you been training at? House of Athletes in Western Florida. Snoop and Sam. Yeah. Just having them by your side, how valuable or how cool has that been? It's been great, man. I mean, I've just always been comfortable, you know, having two of my best guy friends around me while I'm training and going through this process and and also having somebody that's in the same room as me is, is great to have. I mean, me and Snoop would always study together. Um, he would teach me things that I didn't know and I would do the same. And so it was great having him there. I mean, I've had him for the last three years and so it's always been great having him. He's a good resource to have. Uh, I probably made it up with like probably like the state game or something, or before, a little bit before then. What you Following? To be honest with you, man, I ain't even watch football. <laughs> I don't even watch sports like that. Honestly, I just watch highlights. <laughs> Oh, yeah, of course. Um, I'm an old school type of guy. I like my favorite running back of all time and the best running back of all time, Barry Sanders. Um, two on the list, I'll probably have to go um, homegrown native, Walter Payton, you know. Um, third, I'll put somebody new in there. So I'll just go 
Third, my favorite back, Kamara. Alvin Kamara. In today's league, Alvin Kamara is my favorite back. Um, just playing in space, being able to catch the ball out of the backfield and being able to line up in a slot and being able to attack a team deep as well.